Welcome to another teacher tip with Mr. Long and in this lesson we're going to look at how we can take our PowerPoint and make it into a video. Maybe you want to send a video to your class or you want to make a, a flipped classroom type style video. So how do I record my lovely little slideshow? First of all obviously you need to create your slideshow. Make sure that it's got all the slides that you want and that you're ready with how you're going to present it. That obviously takes the most of the time is making sure that you've got everything ready so that your your recording can go as smoothly as possible. Once you're ready with your little, uh, I'm going to just do this little quick little slideshow here to just talk about venues and stuff like that. Let's say I want to send a message to, on a WhatsApp group and stuff like that. Say, so, guys, th these are the venues you need to go to and just explain things. So once I've got my PowerPoint ready, then I'm going to come here to slideshow and you'll see there's an option to record slideshow. So you can come over here. So we're going to record from the beginning. Or from the current, from the current, from the current, from the beginning. Yeah, so we won't start at the very beginning. And so this will pop up. So we've got lovely little tools here. We can start recording there. We can stop. We can replay. If you've got notes, you can view your notes here. So, but this is the part that gets recorded and you can actually jump through your slides like this if you want to. Um, so that is available to you. You can clear stuff if you want. And you've got all these tools at the bottom, which are so cool. Like you can actually draw things. And so you can actually use this to pen to draw or highlight or you can erase things. You'll notice that my microphone is is at the moment it's turned off, but it'll obviously turn on. So we can come here to settings. I'm gonna got the microphone. That's the microphone I want to use. And I've got the webcam if I want to use it. But at the moment, my microphone is on because there's no slash to it. So now the microphone's on there. I, if I want to record, uh, turn the video on, I can do that. That'll set up the webcam and so on like that. So those are the type of things that you can play around. I've got a face for radio, so therefore my face will not appear in the video. Uh, that's what my mom told me. She said I had a face for radio. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, so let's try this uh, recording. So let's go. I'm going to start recording and let's see what happens. So I'm going to record and it gives me a little countdown. And welcome to our video. So we're going to talk about the venues you need to go to. So Abby, you need to go to room 3B and uh, Richard, you need to go to lab uh, 1A. And then please take note. I'm going to draw here. It is lab, not room 1A. So you can make sure that you know that. So I'm doing some terrible drawings here. And I can just take that away, take all that away. Um, and then uh, Malachi, you must go to 3F. And Tiana McKenzie, you must go to 5A. And there we go. Those are the venues. Okay. Does everyone know where they need to go? Great. I'm stopping the recording there. So now I've done the recording. You can replay to see what it's like. Um, you can play around with it. We're going to go, okay, so we've done our recording. That's great. So now that I've done my recording, what do I do? Um, well, you can see there it says that there's a recording on these different slides, which is great. And that. So I've got my recording. Um, okay, so what I do now, I'm going to go here to file and I'm going to export and under export. This is not save as export. You can create a video. So I'm going to use that. You can even create an animated GIF for those of you who watched our videos on how to create images. You can even create an animated GIF if you want. But yeah, maybe we should do a video on animated GIFs. Okay, so create a video, sidetrack. Um, Create a video. Yes, we want to use the recordings that we used for at the moment that we used now. Um, and you can specify the size. The size is quite important because that's going to determine the quality. Um, obviously, the better the, the, the quality, the better the images. So if you've got lots of particular images that you want them to analyze, you might want a higher quality one. But just be aware that as you go high in the quality, the size gets a lot, quite large. So if you're going to put this on a website for the kids to download, or if you can send it on a WhatsApp group, you might want to make it a bit smaller so that it's more easier for them to be able to download it because they don't want to use up too much data, especially if they're watching it on their phone. So I'm going to make it nice and small because I want to make it quickly. Um, so we're using the record, use the rec slides with recordings. So yeah, we want to use the timings and the recordings that we used. So use the recorded timings and narration. So there we go. And we're going to create the video. Boom. Great. It's going to ask me where do I want to save it. I'm saving in the folder. I'm going to call it as recording. Save. And at the bottom here, you can see it's busy trying to create the recording. Now, because my quality is quite low, it'll go relatively quickly. And because my video is quite short. But if you've got a longer video or a higher quality video, then the, the, the creating part might take a lot longer. So just be patient about that. Okay, so there we go. That was quite and short. So now I'm going to go to my folder. And there we go. You can see there is my video that was made right now. And we are going to play it. So let's go open it up. So yeah, I've opened up the video in a, a video player, a media player. Um, so there's a recording. So let's play it. Let's see what it looks like or what it sounds like. Welcome to our video. So we're going to talk about the venues you need to go. So Abby, you need to go to room 3B. And, uh, 
Richard, you need to go to lab uh, 1A and then please take note. Okay, that's enough of me for you. Don't want to, I don't know how you guys hear my voice all the time. So just take note, when you are transitioning from size, there's a little bit of delay in the sound. So when you go from slide to slide, make sure that you pause a little bit just to give your it's time to record your sound and stuff like that. But it does go quite nicely. So now I've got this nice little video. It had all the little drawings in. You see that? And even when I took it out, so there we go. It's all the stuff there. It's a video that's nice and ready. It's a 21 second video. That's great. And now you can send this little video on WhatsApp or whatever to your students. So there we go. That's how you make a video using your PowerPoints. For more videos on PowerPoint, go to our YouTube channel. Click on that subscribe button. Go to our playlists. You'll see a list of everything there. Leave a like, leave a comment. We'd love to hear from you. What videos do you want us to make? And remember, don't do it the long way. Do it the Mr. Long way.